Elijah, my beautiful bride-to-be. I left this letter until last because I knew it would bring up all the emotions. I love you and I'm so proud of you. I feel like I could say a thousand things, but for now, <laughs> I love you, boss baby. <laughs> Elijah and I were born one day apart and always thought of each other to be basically our twin. It's wild to think that what feels like not long ago, we were little girls dreaming of who we'd grow up to marry one day. And the day is finally here and I hope it's more than both of you could have ever imagined. Apart from you trying to pin everyone down and wrestle them every time you have two standard drinks, I think you, I think you are a pretty decent bloke. But the one thing that I have and always will love you for is the is the fact that I know whatever the time, wherever you are, if I ever need something, I can always pick up the phone and give you a call. Well, Elijah, you look absolutely stunning and you have made your parents very proud. 25 years ago you came into our lives and you've only enhanced them ever since. I can't believe we've made it to our wedding day. Two years of planning and being engaged, done, and now we get to enter into this next chapter as husband and wife. I'm so excited to call you my husband. I can't wait to see your handsome face at the hour later today and party with you and our loved ones tonight. See you soon. Love you always, Mrs. Britton. I'm lost, but on my way. strength I need each morning and the reason I'm grateful each night. You've helped me through my lowest of lows and celebrated my highest of highs. Andrew, you are my best friend. I love the kind, generous and hardworking man that you are. Thank you for being a friend to lean on, a person to laugh with and for teaching me to appreciate the small things in life. You're my partner in crime, my soulmate and I cannot wait to call you my wife. You are my safe person. Andrew, you are my home. As we start a new chapter today, I'm sure there'll be new challenges that await us. I promise I'll be by your side, through thick and thin. From this day forward, I promise to love and respect you, support you, understand and listen to you. I promise I'll be your biggest motivator and your biggest fan. Most of all, I promise that every day, I'll love you more than the last. I promise to grow with you and nurture a home filled with love, light and laughter. I love you, Andrew, now and always. You have kissed over a thousand times, but this time, this feeling is different. This is your moment. I'm delighted to now pronounce you husband and wife. You can seal the deal with a kiss. up for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. Britton. Such a special day it's been witnessing this beautiful couple exchange vows beside the billabong that Andrew's grandparents lovingly created and maintained for over 30 years. May I thank you all for attending and in particular those who have covered long distances from around the country. When we're coming home, bring out the best traits in each other and there are certainly no limits to what you can achieve together. You've already proven that so far at such a young age. 
I couldn't be prouder to have you as my closest friends. The two people, the beautiful couple, Mr. and Mrs. Britton, for the first time, let's welcome them in. Make some noise for Elijah and Andrew Britton. So Andrew is kind of like Andy from the show, The Nard Dog. He is a confident, generous, handsome, funny. Am I getting married to you? Webster's Dictionary defines wedding as the fusing of two metals with a hot torch. Well, you know something, guys? I think you're two metals, gold medals. And for those who don't know, he was Google searching welding. Andrew, you, you display a maturity beyond your years, although I'm told there is a second personality lurking. <laughs> we have entrusted you with someone so very precious. Please respect, love, and cherish her. I can't wait to see you two make the most wonderful parents one day, can continue to achieve incredible things together or whilst holding each other up and bringing out those wonderful qualities in each other that are the reasons that you fell in love. We went through lockdown together, witnessing many phone calls of Andrew, calming Elijah's anxieties and a lot of third wheeling. <laughs> and to my dearest Elijah, I proudly welcome the title of mother-in-law as I could simply not ask for a more beautiful, compassionate and loving soul to bless my son's life. Now, like Andrew, I will keep this quite short. <laughs> On to Elijah, or Beef for short. That's for the real fans. You're an amazing person and I couldn't imagine anyone better to be by Andrew's side. I love both of you and wish you the happiest lives together. Can we charge our glasses and toast to a lifetime of happiness? I love you both. Thank you for asking me to do this. Now that I don't have any more responsibilities, I'm just gonna get drunk. I love you both individually and together. So Andrew and Elijah, hope you get the lot. And everyone just raise a glass to Mr. and Mrs. Britton. Let's fucking try! Oh. <laughs>